hello friends welcome to my channel in this video we will learn how to find fillet weld sizes like leg length if throat is given and how to find throat if leg length is given so we will under, understand this in our today's video but before explaining the calculations let me explain you what is throat and what is leg length so suppose this is a fillet joint then the distance from the root to the toe of the weld is called as leg length leg length and it is often denoted by the alphabet z and the distance from the root to the surface of the weld is called as the throat and it is often denoted by a so this one is the leg and this one is the throat length now there is a relation between throat and leg that is if you have to find out throat then throat can be calculated by multiplying the leg from 7.707 .707 and leg can be calculated by multiplying the throat from 1.414 so if you will multiply throat into 1.414 you will get leg and if you will multiply leg into uh, leg from 0 0.707 then you will get throat now we'll understand this with the help of an example we'll take the example and we'll try to understand we'll try to solve the problem so that it will be easier for you to understand in first scenario we'll calculate or we'll find out throat suppose leg is given like leg length is leg length is 8 mm and you have to find out the throat you have to find out the throat throat is equal to what and in the second case throat is given in the second case for example throat is 6 mm and you have to find the leg length so will understand both as I told you earlier a is equal to 0 0.707 into z so a is the throat and z is the leg length we will put the values 0 0.707 into z our leg length is 8 mm so 0 0.707 into 8 and this will come as 5.65 so this is mm the eight this one is also mm leg length is 8 mm so the throat will come as 5.65 mm if leg is 8 mm then the throat will be 5.65 mm now we'll take the second case if throat is given we have and we have to find out the leg length so the formula is z equal to 1.414 z is equal to 1.414 into into a so z is leg length and a is throat now I'll put the values 1.414 into a is 6 mm so 1.414 into 6 and we'll find it uh, after calculation we'll find this value 8.484 so the leg will come as 8.484 so if you try to you know observe the things see our throat was 6 mm leg is 4.8.484 and when our leg was 8 mm the throat is 5.65 so one more thing the leg will always be greater than the throat here you can see leg will always be greater than the throat I'll show this in a diagram also if 
this the leg is z and throat throat is a then z will always be greater than a leg length will always be greater than the throat in case of isosceles triangle if both the legs are equal and these two calculations are also valid when both the legs are equal these two calculations are valid only when both the legs are equal so friends with this we have come to an end of our today's video hope you like this video thank you very much